Good morning. Jonathan York here from IRG Bay of Plenty with comments on the Reserve Bank uh, rate announcements. Jonathan, the rates were unchanged. Wasn't that expected? Uh, morning, Lauren. Yes, it was pretty much expected. The Reserve Bank would leave rates unchanged this morning. Um, the issue the Reserve Bank has, it's a fine tightrope they are walking between trying to keep the economy growing through the uh, uh, low interest rate policy, but also as well trying to uh, talk and keep the currency down as it approaches 70 versus the US dollar. Um, the issue with the US with the uh, dollar against the US is it's more a case of US weakness rather than New Zealand strength, um, but obviously it's not really helping the exporters. Um, housing is on the rise again. Is this a worry for the Reserve Bank? Uh, yes, it is, Lorne. The, uh, the housing bubble we've experienced over the last 12 to 18 months, um, no one really wants to see a repeat of that. And there is a, a, a real issue of trying to keep uh, say trying try to keep interest rates at a reasonable level without stimulating a housing bubble going forward over the next sort of two to three years. Jonathan, how does the investor take advantage of rising interest rates? With a rising interest rate uh, cycle, what you have to do is uh, look to reduce your duration. So you just look to move to shorter maturities to take advantage of potential uh, rate increases further down the road. Um, or you can look at annual resets. Um, there are quite a few of these uh, available on the New Zealand Stock Exchange already. Examples would be uh, ASB, the, um, CBA and the uh, Rabobank, Bank, which you get uh, reset every year. So as interest rates increase, you then take advantage of that for the next 12 months. Thank you, Jonathan. For a disclosure document and more information, call IRG on 0800 867 323 or Taronga 578 3863. Thank you very much. Thank you.